Betty from Oklahoma said, I hear many workers in the energy industry earn a good wage. What type of training or educational opportunities should my children pursue if they wish to work in the energy sector? Uh, that's a great question, and, and it's something we focus on at Energy Day as part of our Energy Day Festival in Houston, Texas, which will be on October 20th. Workforce development and, and exciting kids and college-age folks on science and technology and engineering and mathematics, there are abundant jobs in the energy sector. And it's actually an aging workforce, so there's, there's good opportunities as you move forward. Um, but in terms of kind of community colleges, a lot of community colleges, a lot of universities around the country, University of Houston, University of Texas, uh, the Dakotas are now really ramping up what they're doing in, in, in energy and from a, a, both a vocational and a community college standpoint, all, all, the, all the different academic institutions in those states. Uh, you're seeing more and more in Pennsylvania as the Marcellus uh, becomes uh, you know more robust and, and ramps up and creates ancillary jobs throughout the economy. So there's a lot of opportunities, but capturing that at a young age, making sure that your children maintain that good, strong interest in the sciences for a future in engineering and mathematics, that's the best way to do it. There's And, and then looking for electricians and others. Offshore development uh, has a lot of opportunities for those vocationally trained uh, professionals that can come out and do a great job and they're high-paying, high-wage jobs as, as you mentioned.